blessings. I understand the miracles. I understand the favor of God. But at the same time, you've got to ask yourself, what would it profit me if I gained all of that and still died and lost my soul? How well off am I? If I got all of that stuff going for me, I work at the church. Boy, y'all getting quiet now. Come on, the payroll at church and still die and lose yourself. You've got to understand Jesus is coming back. This ain't no time to play. Amen. Here it is now, the preacher trying his best to get you right and ready to go back with Jesus when it comes. Okay. And you'd rather play around and don't play I'm around. Don't play to, around. I'll hear them preach on miracles one more Sunday. Listen, heaven is full of miracles. You, Amen. You gotta get there. Amen. You, Lord, look at them get. And I'm telling you, I'm telling you now, I, don't, I ain't going to heaven, poor. I, I, I ain't going to heaven without having everything. I want. Listen, can I tell you what the Bible says? The Bible said it's just important that you make it to heaven at all costs. See, we got this thing mixed up. We thought God was all about blessing us down here. But did you know the ultimate goal of your salvation and of God's keeping power is to keep you until he can present you unto himself? Child, I can't help it, Apostle. You don't even understand. It's easy for you to talk that kind of stuff. And see, I got to be careful preaching stuff like this because folk now don't have the common sense people had years ago. But, but you preach know what the Bible said? I'm going to tell you. The Bible said if your Kim. foot offends you, it's better for you to cut your own foot off and make it into heaven hopping Amen. than to have both your feet in hell. Amen. Now he ain't tell you to just chop your foot off now. You ain't got to just come on down and get the Holy Ghost. You ain't got to worry about all that. He said if your eyes are giving you trouble and if your eyes are going to keep you out, he said it's better for you to pluck your eyes out and go to heaven blind than it is for you to go to hell with two good eyes. In other words, all he's trying to tell you, don't you let nothing and don't you let nobody keep you from getting oh God into the Don't you. Don't you let nobody or uh, nothing. Tonight that didn't mind helping me preach for a minute. Preach it. Preach it. And tell them, I'm going by any means necessary. I'm going by any means necessary. Look at y'all ain't talking. If I got to go blind, I'm going to get there. If I got to give up all my stuff. Okay. Okay. You got some folks, Lord have mercy. They willing to hold on to clothes. They willing to hold on to jewelry. Oh, God. But listen, let me tell you something. If God told me I couldn't wear socks no more, honey, I ain't got to wear no socks. Amen. As a matter of fact, when I get to heaven, he ain't even got to give me no slippers. Just let me walk around and go. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. It ain't going to be about the clothes I wear. As a matter of fact, if you don't give me no robe, just give me a t-shirt and let me walk around in heaven. Mm, Get your mm, mm, saying mm, nothing here. Mm, I ain't got to live in no mansion. Mm, mm. I'll be happy just to be there. Oh, yes. All right, all right. I'm one of those people that's got to make it in. Me too. Me too. You let nothing and nobody keep you out of the kingdom. Don't let no uh, nobody keep you out the kingdom. Say, 
sanctify it. I'm going to let some and somebody keep me out of hell. The devil is a liar. The devil so is a lie. Holding on to vices and stuff that ain't gonna profit you at all, and trying to hold on to this stuff because you think it make you look good. And why well, y'all gonna get quiet? Can I preach for a minute here? You got to understand, child of God. God said if you're willing to walk away from this, I heard him declare that no man I've been left houses and land and mothers and fathers mm, and mm, riches mm. in this world. He said yes, I can give you that stuff down here, but your goal ought to be to get it back in heaven. All right, you too, family. I was just sharing y'all, sharing with y'all what I'm listening to. Yes, yes. Don't let nobody take you away from God, because that's the only way in through Jesus. And when that day comes, you want to be in that number when the saints go marching in. All right, now. I'm out.